Hey, it's the day before Lambertville, and I'm at what's going to be our next clean out. We have uh, this building here. We got stuff to take out of the back building that doesn't have a ton of stuff. It's got some. Um, I'm sorry, I thought I saw it. Must have been a deer jumping. Look at a turkey vulture sitting on top of the roof. Or it's a. But I don't have to do this building here. This is an old chicken crib or chicken pen. Um, but I really like the texture on this corn crib. Got some good galvanized uh, in there. Oh, another turkey vulture. But I don't know exactly what's in here. We'll find out. Uh, I know there's a bunch of scrap. The canoe stays. But let's see, like this butcher block. That butcher block's nice. I can get some money for that. And there's a couple sinks. Good aluminum ladder. Um, not too much up here, in here. A few things. But what I did was I traded them for the stuff in this one building. Because there's all these paintings and everything else. That little end white thing is a little workshop. So I'm going to do this clean out for free because of what I saw in here. Um, me, Ben, and Naz are going to show up and throw all this into a big, uh, big storage room. But see them right here? I got stone buddha antique clock big dragon pot sterling candlestick i mean look at this chinese guy he's freaking awesome but uh there's two more it says two dragon pots so they have huge dragons on the side i mean just cool stuff. Some brass scrap. But look at all this Chinese pottery back here. Some old records. A little block and tackle. I just felt like I didn't even go through this stuff, but I felt like I'd be able to make money. These cool pieces of stainless steel. But I figured for Lamberville, I was going to grab these big pots since it's going to rain tomorrow set of horseshoes this thing's cool I have no clue what it is maybe it's a bocce um, also I thought these paintings see this painting I think that could be worth something I don't know if it's worth a ton I just think it could be worth something Weird Chinese guy. But the stuff's been in here for a bit. Not too many little wood boxes or anything. It's all cardboard. Looks like somebody's went through every box, but they definitely definitely left some money in here. Um, must have been looking for something else besides stuff I make money on but yeah I'm gonna take those pots right now and then I'm gonna go uh, pick up some other stuff for Lamberville everything here is all like pots and artwork like weird owl I don't know I mean it feels like we're gonna find some stuff in here so I wonder if there's an upstairs 
Nope. Just the way it is. And then, so, oh wow, look at that. Honeybee hive. See it? That's cool. Native honey beehive. I wonder if, uh, I guess I should tell a beekeeper. Maybe they'll want it. This, there was just scrap metal I saw. Wasn't too much else besides scrap metal. Um, really old chest rotted out. There's a nice little uh, stove and a golf cart. But where the money is, like whoever bought this, this floor is worth a ton of money. It's all nice concrete, not cracked. Definitely took uh, took some money to put this in here. These are all old chicken pens. Um, you could build a really nice structure on this, even though this one's kind of falling down now. But we'll see. Uh, I'm not going to take anything apart, really. I'm just going to grab the stuff from that building, and I was told I didn't have to touch this too much so I'm gonna leave it be I kind of wish I I bought this property it's definitely neat um, this is a spiral staircase but it's got to be uh, either sellable or uh, I mean no it's scrappable but what isn't it's kind of neat though Old saw horses kind of rotted out though and she said there was pictures in here somewhere Chinese chest, speakers, and more pictures. I'll have to go through the pictures once Naz is here. Let him have that discovery. Hopefully there's something good. But, I don't know, that big painting on the other uh, side is definitely sellable. Um, and the ceiling in here is... Uh, Here's a cool little trap door up there. The ceiling in that building is uh, definitely kept it dry. So I'll show you the other other one, and then I'm going to load those pots and go load up my rest of my stuff for Lamberville. <sighs> This is an old weight for you know, put your horse on it. This stuff's mostly garbage. There's a little bit of scrap in here. They got a weight set. I can sell the weights. So I'll scrap the rest. And gotta throw out the couch. Stuff in the middle is staying. But the rest of the stuff's going. Some scrap batteries. Nothing, I mean, it's pretty clean. Just in there, uh, they have the closing, and in the closing, they had this and the other building. Uh, they're supposed to be cleaning it out. So. I 
and all the stuff in that little side building, like with that, with the weird Chinese stuff, was her great aunt's. When uh, she passed, they uh, they put everything in there. Everything in here goes. Uh, I mean. I don't know if there's anything good in here or not, but copper. Um, looks like they cleaned everything else out. So it's a couple. It's probably going to take me, Naz, and uh, that seems to be a nice one. Me and Naz, and I think Dirty's going to come over and help see if he can find anything for him. Uh, it's going to take us about four or five hours to throw all this into a dumpster. And you guys will get to see what I sell everything for at, uh, at Columbus. I mean at Lambertville. So definitely was definitely is a neat piece of property though that that barn super old somebody put that uh, the roofing shingles on the side of it wonder if there's a millstone because this is over by a by a river millstones are worth a ton I see some concrete over here. See, like, see this old wall here? I guess that kind of keeps everything elevated because that's all wetlands over there. But, still might be one in here somewhere. A lot easier finding all this stuff in uh, the winter time. I'll go show you guys the the river. Yeah, you could tell they had a little mill here. See it? just enough to do your grain or whatever. I don't know. Definitely find some pretty things sometimes. I would think a uh, problem with this property, see where the, the house and the barn is? Probably uh, in the flood zone. Whenever you're in the flood zone, it uh, you have to pay, pay that flood insurance. So that can be a impossible task for some people. Man, that water sounds cool. There's a lot of little skeeters out here. All right, I'm gonna get back to you and show you what I put on the truck. So far, I've loaded on these two mystery, or th actually the three dragon uh, plates, and then there's two boxes of mystery uh, paintings. I am going to save the rest of this to do with Naz, but this window is broken, so I just want to look under this because it is supposed to rain. Let's see what's in this. Clothes. I'm so lucky to have clothes. Ooh. Again, everything's just how I found it. These are looks like some type of glass slider. I got birds. 
slaying babies, but trees. It'd be neat if some of these have photos. Let's see what this is. That's pretty darn cool. 1910. Astronomy stuff. Picture of like one of the first outer galaxies. That must have been blowing people's minds back then. That guy must have been an astronomer. I don't know. Definitely some neat little photos. Let's see what this is. Oh, that's pretty cool. New Hampshire, cotton. Uh, must be, uh, it's Chinese guys. They must have went to China. Boxing fight, bet these will sell. 1904 China. Oh, that would be awesome. The sun and Venus. I guess it's. I'll have to figure out who this guy was. What's this say? 1915. Let's see. Oh, wow. Their trip to China in 1915. That's pretty neat. That's got to be good. I don't know. I'm not going to mess with it. It's going to rain. Let's see what's... what's let's go look real fast. Put this in. I'll go in. We got two of these tins, so... Makes me wonder what is August 1948. More glass photos, but all right, that came out of this box. Oh, poor bunny broke his ear. That's a shame. That blue one's a good one, too. Actually, they're both good. All the pieces are there. Maybe we'll glue it together. Give it somebody who cares to glue it together. Those are both old. But that one next to the window got some water. Let's see. Maybe there's photo trip to China. That would be good. That was probably... He was an astronomer. He probably taught... Uh, looks like his class lectures. Oh, well. I mean, they're sellable, but they're not... Huge, huge, huge money. Basically, like a overscreen projector for uh, teaching. All right, let's. I'll try one more. But those two, two tins are pretty darn neat. And Photographs. No. 
small lecture. Might be lucky to get uh, um, see it's all different lecture stuff. That's a shame. Here, that one has a stamp on it. Nope. Yeah, somebody will find it interesting, but I was just hoping. This stuff can be thousands of dollars if it's all photographs. Because then you can get $10, $15 each. I mean, somebody will still buy this, but... It's not worth what it would be if it was all photos. So, it's all good. I'm happy. There's uh, another clock back there, so three clocks. I moved those big big three in. We're going to go to Lamberville tomorrow, and I'll s hopefully sell these in the rain. So, let's see how cool the dragon is on the side. He is super neat. So, definitely, uh, I don't know, good find. All right, everybody, uh, we're going to, I'll get another video of us cleaning this place out. I'll end with the bees, though. The bees are just super busy. That's how everybody should be. You guys get around like... Once they start bouncing off you, you know you're too close. You can hear them. That is so cool. Wonder how much honey is behind that wall. It could have been there for years. Wish I had a. I don't really have a friend that's a beekeeper to come uh, save this. Hive. Not that the hive's gonna die, it's just, you know, honeybees do get uh, that mite. probably takes up that whole inner wall, this hive. Mm -hmm. eh, they were getting close. Again, they'll tap you twice before they sting you. I'll try one more time. <laughs> they were definitely going after the light. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to drop you guys. I didn't get tagged though. Oh, they're still after me though. They got my scent. So it's time to go. All right. <laughs> he was like stuck right there on the thing trying to sting my finger. But luckily he was going after the... He's still angry. He's right there. But all right. Hope you guys like that. Peace.